Happy Latin American Heritage Month, America. I'm Captain June Tenth. History is fundamental, so let's talk about the first Latino to win the Nobel Prize in Physics, Luis Alvarez. Luis Alvarez was born on June 13, 1911 in San Francisco, California. He studied physics at the University of Chicago, receiving his bachelor's, master's, and PhD. In 1945, he became a faculty member at the University of California, Berkeley. Alvarez discovered that some radioactive elements decay by orbital electron capture, producing an element with an atomic number smaller by one. In 1939, he and Felix Bloch made the first measurements of the electron's magnetic movement, which is characteristic of the strength and direction of its magnetic field. He also participated in developing microwave beacons, linear radar antennas, the ground control landing approach system, and a method for aerial bombing using radar to locate targets. After World War II, Alvarez helped construct the first proton linear accelerator and later developed the liquid hydrogen bubble chamber in which subatomic particles and their reactions are detected. In the 1980s, along with his son, geologist Walter Alvarez, he discovered a worldwide layer of clay high in iridium. They theorized that the iridium was deposited following the impact of an asteroid or comet 65 million years ago, thus wiping out the dinosaurs. Although their theory was initially controversial, it's widely accepted as the most plausible explanation for the animal's extinction. Luis's Alvarez's contribution to physics and his role in the Manhattan Project have solidified his legacy as the most brilliant and productive experimental physicist of the 20th century.